Mark Anthony y con Freezing Success. Tito Nieto. Luis Enrique. Powerful La India. Late Great Cheo Feliciano. What do all these cats have in common? They were all produced by the same guy, the great Sergio George. Born and raised in East Harlem, New York, Sergio George started his professional career with the bands Conjunto Caché and Conjunto Clásico in 1979. He later became the main visionary behind the Latin group label based in New York called RMM Label and Video. George is also the head behind the careers of Salsa Group DLG and Salsa Superstar El Sonero de la Juventud, Victor Manuel. But Victor Manuel and DLG weren't produced under RMM. They were produced under George's own producing venture called George Entertainment. He later continued his producing ventures with a Latin label called WEA Latina a label that has the credits of working with artists like Ricardo Arjona, Gloria Trevi, Marco Antonio Solís, and Tito Nieves. Sergio George continued his producing ventures, forming one of the biggest Latin group music in modern music history, called the Salsa Giants, formed with artists already mentioned like Marc Anthony, Tito Nieves, and the late Cheo Feliciano, including other Latin greats like Andy Montañez, Oscar de Leon, Willy Chirino, and Jose Alberto El Canario. Sergio York has been very, very, very successful throughout his career, winning a total of 11 Grammys and being credited on over 200 million albums. That's working on over 200 million albums. That's a lot. I, but I think his most successful work yet has been that of Mark Anthony's Vivir Mi Vida song. A song that has been the top charted salsa song of all time in the Latin billboards. Also, his work with the Salsa Giants has taken him all over the world spreading and keeping the name of Salsa alive. Well, that's all for now. Thanks for watching the behind the scenes, behind the music, quick run of Sergio George's career. Tune in for the next one. My name is Adriel Longo Santoni. Thanks for watching.